Hello, welcome to Revelator Out. So in this video, I'm talking about how to convert a single uh, voltage from a battery uh, and increase that voltage uh, with a, a whole load of batteries. So if you saw a previous video, I converted one of these uh, into, well, a, this is a 12 volt pack and I use it to test uh, engine components, electrical engine components. So simulating the power from a car battery. Okay, so if you don't have one of these, then what you can do is actually get a whole series of batteries like that. Uh, these are 1.5 volts, so you basically need uh, one, two, three, uh, eight, eight of these to uh, generate 12 volts. So how do you do that? Well, you basically have to love lots of bits of wire and lots of uh, insulation tape, and this is the way you do it. So check out this little procedure, uh, which you basically take uh, one positive from one battery and hook it up to the negative from the next battery, flip it over, take that positive, hook it over to the negative on that battery, positive to negative, all the way along until you have uh, one positive from one battery, one negative from another battery, and that will take it all the way up to uh, um, have whatever voltage you want. So basically I've got 10 batteries here but I'll show you with the the eight batteries that's over 12 volts and then with the um, 10 batteries you can make that up to 14 volts. Okay I should show you now. So these are uh, UK batteries and these are C, uh, C size and they're 1.5 volts. Okay so what you need to do is actually wire them up in series. So basically you get the positive Okay, and it goes to the negative. Then you get the positive to the negative, positive to the negative, positive to negative, until you have a negative from the first battery and the positive from the last battery, and then that will actually create the five volts. So this is 1.5, 1.5, that's three. So basically you need four of these, which uh, will add up to 12 volts. Right, so follow me through, I'm gonna show you how you do it. Okay, so you get the first, batteries together, tape them together, and you're going to need some wire to actually attach like that, cross over like that, and basically just get some tape. Get some tape, put over, and then one like that, and the next one like that. Okay. Then I'm going to swip it over. Okay, just move that wire out of the way for a minute. Then run it over, and then we're going to go from this side here to this side here with another wire. Okay, so this is all we're going to do. So we're going to snip this one off here, go to there, and do exactly the same thing. So the best thing to do actually is to tape all the batteries together, okay? All in a row, like that. Okay, so we've got the first set wired up. Now we go to the second set here, and we're gonna wire that one to that one. Okay, so basically you wired now the uh, batteries in series, positive to negative, positive to negative, all the way along. So you've got one positive and one negative uh, on the batteries. Right. Get a multimeter just to prove this all works. So we should read in the region of uh, 12 volts. Okay, so uh, now I've wired up all 10 batteries, exactly the same procedure, and I'm just gonna push the positive and negative there, and you can see it's up to 14, 15 volts now, just under 15 volts. So basically, that is them all in series. So there you go. If you want to increase the voltage of uh, batteries or to simulate a car battery, just to test some electrical components, you can either do as I've done with this, just buy one of these uh, cages which will hold all the batteries, possibly that's the easiest way to go, or if you really need to do something at home, just lots of electrical tape, bits of wiring, 
wire all the batteries in series, positive to negative, positive to negative, all the way along the batteries, and then just use the first and last battery to have your positive and negative. Then there you go. Then you'll uh, jump up the the uh, the voltage. The amperage will stay the same, but the voltage would increase. Right. Well, I hope you found this useful at least. Uh, it may get you out of a little sticky situation if you need to test something. And uh, well, catch you on the next video whenever that is. Please subscribe. Check out the website revelatoralpha.com. All the links in the description below, and all the support uh, pages there as well. Cheers now. Revelator Alpha.